I am doing my makeup for the lip sync video. I am going to be doing the lip sync to Stu's song, sung by Ed Helms in The Hangover, and I'm dressing up like a tiger in my tiger onesie, so I'm doing tiger makeup. So here we go. I started already by feathering out my brows. I don't really know what I'm doing. Oh shit, sorry. I gotta get my tape out because I'm gonna be doing my cat eye eyeliner. It's gonna be the greatest summer of our lives. We're gonna go pretty heavy on the eyes here. Hope that this goes well. Because I don't know what else to do. And something fell in the trash. I bet you didn't know that you were going to be getting makeup and a show. That's how I do it. Gotta go in with the lighter color first. And I'm going to do this like shimmery white. It's called Curious by Unique. I wet my brush. I want it to be pretty opaque. <sighs> oh my God, I learned something today. I learned a fun fact today. A group of polar bears is called a celebration. How cool is that? That was the most fun fact I heard all day. All right, so we've got this like white base, real heavy. I'm going to go back later and put some white underneath the eye because if you look at a tiger's face, it has like that white under there. I'm really, really excited about this challenge. I have well, eyeshadow, just it's literally everywhere. It's all over my face. That's cool. It's cool. It's fine. It's fine. I, I don't know. I'm going to do a pretty dramatic eye here. We need some brown on the lid. So we're going to throw some of that in here. We'll figure it out. Really big dramatic line. This part is like so flimsy. I like it to be a little bit more stiff. That's what she said. When I'm doing my liquid liner, I screwed up there. We want to make sure that we're extending this black line down. Oh God, that's terrible. That's terrible. Um, We'll come back to that. I mean, it does not help that I'm terrible at doing liquid liner too. I look like a mess right now. But I promise it's going to look better when it's finished. I watched the video and I think I got it. It's not like I'm going anywhere. <laughs> oh, God. That feels so much better. Now the real fun's going to start. I'm going to use a shadow instead of my normal brow um, liner because... I want to be able to like feather it more because we want to take the line down a little bit to give it more of that cat-like appearance. I'm in the midst of blending concealer and I don't have one of those fancy blending buds or whatever they're called. So I'm using one of these old school sponges. How do drag queens do this? Like how do drag queens put on so much makeup? Like daily. So we have to try to get this whitish, this lighter powder on. We're gonna make a, like a really severe um, cheek bony effect. Cheek bony effect. Apparently I just do whatever I want. And I know I look like a friggin' hot mess right now. I try to make a jawline for myself. Oh, yeah, like I know what I'm doing here. 
I think I have imposter syndrome. Oh yeah. <laughs> this situation that's happening on my face is not attractive right now. Just wetting my brush here because I'm going to go in with that same white that I have on my eyes down here. and create sort of like a mustachioed effect. <laughs> so we're gonna go in with some of that white underneath the black and heaven help me. I hope it turns out. Doing a pretty good job. If I do say so myself. I gotta look at a tiger nose real fast. I gotta figure out this lip thing too. Okay, well, you know, it's time to take the makeup off. I've been sitting here like this for a while because I don't want to take it off because I think it looks awesome. But here goes. <laughs> I look like a chimney sweep. A chimney sweep that has like a lot of eyeliner on. <laughs> you see that? Here's like number two. I think we're gonna need at least three. If anybody's wondering, these are Biore Witch Hazel. Um, <laughs> that's not gonna come off. I had this period of time a couple months ago where my chin was breaking out really badly. So I started using these just as like a go over, like after I washed my face. With my regular soap, I would just like go over my breakout areas with these because witch hazel is supposed to be good for acne. And I don't know why there's like this black smudge on my nose because I had not black there. I had um, a lip stain to fill in that pinkish area. Well, y'all, I guess I'm just going to be walking around with a black stain on my nose. I am going to wash it after this, but I doubt that's going to help anymore. This is so bad. Well, most of it's gone, at least. My face hurts now from rubbing it so hard. That, no. <laughs> that's all right. Okay, well, hopefully y'all enjoyed the video. Bye.